Men, how many of you all are having affairs? And your wife doesn't know yet. And the holidays are coming up. And what are you going to do? Who are you going to spend it with? What are you going to give the mistress? What are you going to give your wife? What galas are you going to attend? Or family events? Who are you going to take? Hmm. And if you have a daughter, how do you think she would feel knowing that her daddy is cheating on her mama? Would you want that done to your daughter? And if not, why are you choosing to do it? Some of you I know would take a baseball bat and whack him upside the head. If your daughter's husband did that to her. So, what's it going to take for you to step into honoring your commitment? Hebrews says this, let marriage be held in honor among all and let the marriage bed be undefiled for fornicators and adulterers, God will judge. Let your character be free from the love of money, be content with all you have for he himself has said, I will never desert you, nor will I ever forsake you. I know, it's become just so mainstream now. Everybody thinks it's okay to have an affair, it's their right, or she's not giving up sex, so I have to take care of my needs somewhere. Who are you fooling? What's it gonna take for you to go back to your marriage and work on your marriage? What's it gonna take for you to look at your life and find out what is not working and how it's affecting other areas of your life? And look at your affair and what you are destroying by having the affair and the repercussions of it. When you're ready to look at your life, I'm here for you. Go sign up on my link tree. Give yourself a holiday gift. Work on you. It overflows in every other area of your life. When you're ready, I'll be waiting. God bless.